welcome back to my channel and today I have uh, two unboxings. I'm trying it from a different angle, which is why I'm staying on the floor. Uh, so I have two uh, Craft of Week kits that just came in the mail. I got this as part of their uh, uh, Santa's Secret Stuffing collection. So they're kits that were um, being discontinued. And so um, that is why they're on a discount. And uh, we got one kit uh due to the fact that they uh just included an extra item uh because they had some stuff lying around the warehouse uh so that is super sweet and uh so i will go ahead and unbox both of these i guess untube one is that what you call it when it's in the tube because you call it boxes when it's in a box unbagging when it's in a bag so i guess this would be untubing it in any case with that being said here you go, just so you can read it, and it has this cute little, these cute little gnomes on the other side of the half sheet. So we'll go ahead and uh, get started. We'll go ahead, I think, and start with the two. And so I am happy that I do have one of these little tubes. So the uh, thing I have is just this, and uh, let's see, this is the Wild Generations Giraffe, and it is by Carol Caballeris, sorry if I'm butchering that. So first we have this, it says craftively, it gives a little bit about them, a little bit about contents, a little bit how to buy and paint, some accessory ideas, and oh, basically what's included in the guarantee. Next we have this cute little sticker. And then we have a whole bunch of pre-cut labels. These are huge, so I'd have to figure out how to put them on this uh, containers I have. I'd probably just cut out the symbols and then uh, either put this on the side of the thing or just leave them here. I'm not quite sure which would be easier. Probably putting them on the same side of the container. But yes, there you go. Um... The drills filled out, here they are. I will go ahead and open those in just a minute, but first we'll go ahead and take a peek at the canvas. So first I'm going to go ahead and roll it back so it might still look better. This is a board glue canvas, so you can go ahead and do this. Do not do that with um, double-sided. glue because it will not work out so well for you. Okay, so we are just uh, making sure that this one is it flat if So here is the painting, our canvas, there is, oops, sorry. There is craftably on top. Both sides have a legend. And then, um, so it is 47 colors. There are two ABs. And then also there is one crystal. So I will not go through all the colors because I think that will be hard. They are, however, all individually little bagged. I am just going to look for the uh, two uh, 
babies and then the crystal and we'll look for those colors. So first we have a little uh, pink AB. AB stands for Aurora Borealis. And they have a special coating on it, iridescent coating on it, to make give them a little extra shine. So that is one. This is the second AB. And then the final thing is uh, these little crystals. They're like nice little red crystals. So we'll go ahead and look to see where they all are on this uh, canvas here. So first, we'll go ahead and start with this uh, pink one. So I guess it makes more sense to put it this way. There you go. And so let's go ahead and look now for the pink one. So it is the percent sign. I still have not found any. Let's see. Oh, there's some right in here. A couple over here. Um, oh, and a few up here. I don't see any others, so it might just be that because there aren't many in here. And then the next is a U. So there are some over here for sure. Some there. Uh, let's see, do we see any anywhere else? Nope, I think they're mainly just in this part of the uh, sunset right here. And then finally, the uh, these crystals are the little plus sign. And plus signs all throughout here and in here and over here. So all through this red layer of um, sunset or pluses. And there's some also down here and over here. Oh, and a few over here as well. Over here and over here as well. So all throughout the sunset, uh, there are little pluses. So I think this is what we will have the most of for sure of the special drugs. So yeah, that is the first one. And give me just a second and I will get to the second one. And then this is the second one. So this one comes, it's one of their newer kids. It comes in a box. This one's called Black Hole in the Milky Way. It is a 24 by 24 inch, or I think that's 60 by 60 centimeters. Uh, it's a round kit. Both of them are round kits. Um, this one's by Tanya Shatsiva. So we have a toolkit and, and let's first go ahead and go over the toolkit. 
So first we have the standard issue plastic pen. This has a four placer already on it. Then we uh, get another four placer and a seven placer. We have the little grippy set of tweezers. One glue pad, square glue pad, and then one uh, tray that's slightly warped, but that's fine. I have plenty of trays. Um, we also get two more um, branded wax, uh, red waxes, the round ones. Get two rolls of washi tape. One looks like it has like either little lanterns or ornaments on it, and then the other one has butterflies, upside down butterflies. There you go. And then has a little cover minder. And this is the cover minder. It's super cute. And so that is the toolkit. I hope we get that away. I do like the little bag. It says craftably on it. Go ahead and set that to the side over here. Then, um, next we have this painting. There's this extra stuff. We'll start with that. So here are the drills, we'll look at those a little later. So first, this is their new sheet. It tells how to diamond paint. It talks about the washi tape and the cover minder. Back there is the one I got. Then it gives uh, what's in the kit and the welcome to the craftably family message. Then we have, oops, it's a gun. Mm. Next, we have the uh, sticker sheet. It has all these are stickers. Um, and then these are all the numbers. It has 62 uh, colors in it, and of which three are ABs, those three. And then the two up here are crystals. <coughs> Excuse me. Once again, the stickers are very large, so I probably would only stick the little symbol on the top and then the codes on the sides of the containers. Here are the drills that this has its the picture on it. And it says its dimensions and the name and everything. I will open this only to get the ABs and the crystals out in just a minute once I get the canvas. So since this is for glue, I can get this, try to get this a little straighter. Flatter. Not do this if it is a uh, double-sided tape, you will be in the world of hurt. Since this is for food, I can go ahead and do this. And here we go. And again, here is the canvas. 
let's see. Let's see if I can reach it up a teeny bit. See if that helps any. Um, get almost off it. There we go. Okay, so that is the full canvas. And so, yeah, um, I hope I haven't opened this to be pretty uh, special girls. I'm not going to take them all out because they are all individually bagged, so I will never get them back in here if I take them all out. So I know since they did in their order, they should all be right in here. So I need to put the eight. Just move these all out of the way. I'll just go through these quickly. So the first three are ABs. So there's this nice like lilac color that's an AB. AB stands for Aurora Borealis and it's a special iridescent coating to make them extra sparkly. Then, second one is this uh, bag of whites. The third one is a pink. And then the, there are the two crystals. So first we have a orange crystal. And then the other is a, a blue crystal. So I will go ahead and look for all of these. Now we will uh, start with the lilac one. And the lilac symbol is the percent sign. So there are some percentages right in here. And some over here. Very few over here. Few in here. A couple over here. I think that's pretty much it. So the next one are these uh, white ones. And that is the letter O. So there are a bunch in the hand here, here and here, and over here there's some. Uh, there's some over here as well. Um, there's a lot on the forehead. Um, there's some throughout here as well. Somewhere over here and over here. 
bunch over here, a few over here, and then they're also all um, confetti throughout sorry, this area as well. Um, and there are a couple more down here as well. And there are a few confetti over here too. Um, the last AB is this pink one here. And it is the, it's a little up carrot. So, let's see, there's some over here, all throughout here, all through here, and even up here. Um, some over here in the face. Um, There are a few confetti in here. Um, that's all I see of those. Um, next we have the orange crystals. And those are this symbol, so there's some here, there's some here, but then mainly there's a bunch, this whole yellow section over here, yellowy orange section over here, and then one there. And a few confetti through here. And I think that's it. And last but not least are these uh, beautiful blue crystals. And they are a check mark. So I think, let's see. So they're all throughout right here. I think this is a fair one. So they're throughout the fair one. There's some over here. Um, yeah, I think that's all I see, but that's uh, plenty. So, um, yeah, overall, I really like these uh, two. Uh, the one in the, uh, the first one I showed you was a um, 20 by 20 inch, or I think that translates to 50.8 by 50.8 centimeters. So they're both squares. Uh, they're both really beautiful, and I can't wait to do them, and I'm super happy I took a chance with the um, sort of mystery-ish uh, aspect to this and uh with that i hope you have a good day and i will see you in my next one bye mm -hmm.